All right, everyone. I'm gonna. I'm doing a, a little follow up here. My previous video I watched and I felt wasn't. It was rather rushed and um, crappy. So, but I wanted to just give like an overall big picture of what what I opened, what I got. Um, so this is um, hoping, um, on my understanding, a split primary. Uh, arrangement here. So your yellows, um, you have this kind of a bright lemon yellow. And this is the one I got, if you want to copy me. Uh, granted, I haven't used these, so I mean, you can copy me if you want, but anyway, oh, this is cadmium yellow light, okay? It's a... <laughs> It is, you can see, P, Y, come on now. It's P, Y, 35. Yeah, P, Y, 35. But what's confusing is that you'll see other colors that are called P, Y, 35, and yet it's a different, a different color. So you know, I don't know what they do to, I guess, I, I mean, I guess they can, you know, do different things to them and get a different color but use the same pigment so you'll see this is like my my warmer yellow so this is called yellow cadmium yellow deep and um, it is oh okay so see this one C has two it's py 35 and po 20 and I even though I was I was trying to get all of them with one pigment and I think I um, I think I just went ahead and, and just got this one because I was, I don't know, I was tired of being nitpicky and I couldn't find, um, basically just, I was trying to keep costs in a certain range <laughs> and I figured, well, my deeper yellow, maybe that's not that, you know, big of a deal. And, um, but anyway, here's a, a, a warmer yellow. And then with the Georgians, like this primary cyan, like this doesn't look like, I'll put, I guess I'll put links just for, for grins to the like teal, like, or the, the cyan teals that you could, I think, use as a, the prime, like a primary cyan. For some reason, they called this their primary cyan and that now it's in focus um pb15 is their they call their primary cyan and you'll see that on that chart um that i shared um and you'll see this hopefully um according to that chart this is more on the greener side whereas this um, this French ultramarine, this is PB29, and it is closer to the red side, the violet red side. So there's my two blues. Um, and the reason why I got this brand is because it was, since it was on sale, all these were on sale, but this just turned out to be cheaper. Um, what I learned, another thing was... The Gamblin 1980 line, their student line, uh, that line, and the Windsor Newton Winton student line, um, they're actually higher. Um, they're more expensive, and plus, they I mean, they were still on sale, but like this is a two, you know, 200 milliliter, 225, and those. The, the Gamblin 1980 and the Winton were uh, 150. I think Winton, I don't know if Winton has 200. Anyway, it was just less paint. Um, so, but um, anyway, here's my magenta red, the PR122. What? What? That's got white in it. Oh. All right, I'm gonna have to do some, 
<laughs> well, I don't I didn't notice that that's my first video so that's kind of irritating because I thought I got this because I picked this because it was just yeah I'm gonna be calling Jerry talking about that anyway and then this is the cadmium red light see this is more of an orangey um, color and it's PR 108 so man dadgummit look at that all right so there's my split ruined split primary thing because of this yeah, it's no big deal okay so anyway and then for bonus um, I thought I'd get a couple like earthy tones and this is called Venetian red as you can you know read that and they theirs is PR 101 now wait oh that's 108 okay so this is PR 101 and um, I think in that previous video that was like a like a some random burnt umber maybe I can't remember but they it was a PR 101 so it was just an example of how you can have different pigments with different names and so here's and then I got this raw umber and uh, I think the PBR just means pigment brown and um, so yeah and apparently those are cheaper like the the browns are uh, I guess cheaper <laughs> so I hear <laughs> or uh, you can get these cheaper all right well there's my thing and I'm gonna look into this and um, I think that's it I hope you enjoy the the uh, horn that went off outside also just for grins this stuff I bought this for some reason I bought like a box of six of these like a moron and this was like years ago and of course I used like one of them but I used this on my palette uh, to clean off the glass and um, it worked really well um, who knows what else you could use it for but um, what else can I tell you I think that's I think that's all um, yeah I'm still wondering about this PW6 PW6 I think that's um, yeah see PW6 that is titanium so I just thought I was getting a single single pigment there so we'll see what happens um, you know life goes on you know um, let's see what uh, let's see I guess that's it um, I'll stop rambling and um, that's really what I wanted to show you just just kind of the, the the overall what I got because um, I know I didn't really go over that in my other video so there it is and uh, thanks for watching